Good evening, all of you. Welcome to my channel, Mathematica, and this is another video of CSI and Net Mathematical Science Problems and Solutions. Now, today's problem is from CSI and Net, December 2023, and this is the problem from numerical analysis. Our question ID is 704096, and this question is from Part C, and marks is 4.75. Here, our problem is the coefficient of x cube in the interpolating polynomial for the data is this. So, we have to find the coefficient of x cube when we interpolate the data in a polynomial. Here, to uh, finding the interpolating polynomial, to find the interpolating polynomial, we have two methods, Lagrange's interpolation formula and Newton's divided differential. At first, we solve it by Newton's divided differential. In this method, we, what we can write that, at first, we write the data in polynomials. This is x and this is f x. Here we calculate first difference. Here second difference, which is denoted as nabla delta f. This is second difference. This is delta square f. This is third difference, which is delta q f, and this is fourth difference, which is delta four. So our data is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. We have to make the table first. Then calculations become so a bit too easier. 1, 2, 1, 3, 5. So our formula for first divided difference is which is denoted as f x0 x1 and the method is f x0 x1 equal to f of x1 minus f of x0 by x1 minus x0 and same similar for the other points. <laughs> so this becomes 1 so f2 minus f1 by 2 x2 minus x1 which becomes minus 1. This becomes 2 and this becomes 2. The second difference, we can find the second difference by this minus this divided by 2 minus 0. So which becomes minus 1 minus 1 minus 2 by 2 which is minus 1. Similarly, 2 minus minus 1 by 3 minus 1 which becomes 3 by 2 and this becomes 0. In the third difference, we can we find that 3 by 2 minus of minus 1 by 3 minus 0, which becomes 5 by 6. And last one is 0 minus 3 by 2 by 4 minus 1, which becomes minus 1 by 2. The fourth difference we can find minus 1 by 2 minus 5 by 6 by 4 minus 0, which is minus 1 by 3. This is the method to okay, uh, find delta f, delta square f, delta q f, and delta 4 f. We subtract f x1 minus f x0 we divide by and divided by x0, x1 minus x0. Then we can find first divided difference. Similarly, for the other uh, other points, at the second difference is f x zero x one, sorry f x two x one minus f x zero uh, x one by x two minus x one. Similarly, uh, we can find the other. Now, our interpolating polynomial becomes p x equal to f of x0, this is the formula, and x minus x0 delta f plus x minus x0 into x minus x1 delta square f plus x minus x0 x minus x1 x minus x2 delta q f plus x minus x0 x minus x1 x minus x2 
x minus x3 and delta 4x. We know the all values. You can put it here. If x0 is 1 plus x minus x0, x0 is 0. So x into delta f, delta f which is 1 plus x minus x0. This becomes x into x minus 1. Since x1 is 1 and delta square f is minus 1 plus similarly we can write other terms x minus x1 x minus x2 into height by 6 and x minus x1 sorry x1 our x1 is x minus x into x minus 1 x minus 2 x minus 3 x1 x2 which is x minus 3 and it is minus 1 by 3. For this problem we don't need to calculate the whole polynomial. We have to find the coefficient of the polynomial of x cube. So we check where x cube becomes. So this can be neglected, this can be neglected and this also can be neglected, neglected because from this x square term becomes. So we neglect it x cube terms comes from here. We multiply it first. x square minus x into x minus x2 means 2 into x minus 2 and this is into 5 by 6 plus x square minus x and multiplying this we get x square minus 5x plus 6 and this is minus 1 by 3. So we can check it so easily that here x cube only becomes x square and multiplying x square and x. So from this we get x 5 by 6 x cube only. No other x cube term becomes from there. For the second term, x cube when we multiply x cube into minus 5x, one x cube term becomes and minus x and x square multiplying another x cube term becomes. So from this we get minus 5x cube minus x cube into minus 1 by 3. So the coefficient becomes 5 by 6 plus minus 6 into minus 1 by 3. So it becomes 5 by 6 plus 2. Even denominator is 6, uh, 6 into 2, 12, 17 by 6. So only this option is correct. Only fourth option is correct. Yeah. Now, if we try to find it by Lagrange's interpolation formula, we can also find this. But it becomes too longer. In Newton's divided difference rule, it becomes quite small. So it uh, we, you can avoid the Lagrange's interpolation formula method. Here we discuss it shortly. X, we can first write the table. X, Y, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 1, 3, 5. In Lagrange's interpolating method, the polynomial becomes X minus, we denote it X, 0, X, 1, x2, x3, x4, x minus x0, sorry, x minus x1, mm -hmm. x minus x1, x minus x2, x minus x3, x minus x4, by x0 minus x1, x0 minus x2, x0 minus x3, 
and h0 minus x squared plus uh, into f of x0 plus the second term becomes x minus x0 x minus x2 x minus x3 x minus x4 by x1 minus x0 x1 minus x2 x1 minus x3 x1 minus x4 into f of x1 plus x minus x2 sorry x0 x minus x1 x minus x3 x minus x4 by x2 minus x0 x2 minus x1 x2 minus x3 and x2 minus x4 f of x2 and we can uh, we can write the other f of x3 and f of x4 this can be written as l summation i equal to 1 to 4 l i x into f of x i where l i equal to x minus x 0 x minus x 1 x minus x i minus 1 x minus x i plus 1 and the other is x minus x n divided by x i minus x 0 x i minus x 1 x i minus x i minus 1 x i minus x i plus 1 and the last is x i minus x n so this is the formula for finding l i on putting this value multiplying this and we can find the coefficient of x n but it becomes too longer so can uh, find shortly by Newton's divided difference method. 